So we're in Slapton. Uh, we're currently in Slapton Wood and we've brought our first years here for a five day field course. And we bring our students out on field courses because we think that field work is a really important skill for biologists to have. Slapton is a great place to come because you have so many different environments including the beach and then you have the fields which are completely different ecology you've got different plants you've got insects you've got invertebrates and then of course the lay where you've got mammals and ducks it just gives you a small sample of loads of different places combined all within a radius of a couple miles we've covered a whole range of skills this week from uh, sampling aquatic invertebrates sampling uh, for mammals we've been looking at plants on the shingle ridge and how they're adapted to live in high salt conditions. So a lot of the skills that we've been learning this week are linked into our accreditation by the Royal Society of Biology. They put down a list of skills that they think that graduates should have and we're using this opportunity to, uh, to give the students those skills. We also really see the students um, becoming a real cohort with like this team spirit because they tend at the beginning to just stick to a few like a small group of friends uh, but after the field courses because we kind of like make them interact with other people um, they make new friends um, and they also all support each other and that's so enjoyable to watch. It's been nice being fully immersed in kind of the biology of it all. We learned how to sample water for a variety of different things that give you an idea of how capable it is of supporting life from algae to invertebrates all the way up to mammals and, and larger organisms. It's a useful skill because at the moment ecological surveys are in high demand in the world of biology, especially with the changing environment. I'm using this recording equipment to get the uh, Chetty's Warbler bird song and we're going to be seeing if there's variability between individuals. So, so far the findings today is that they're incredibly territorial, so they use the bird song to ward off uh, potential threats to their territory. Ones specifically that we found that are more isolated from other members of the territory have more complex bird song. It gives you real world experiences that potential employers will be looking for and also just helping with teamwork skills and also being independent working because you will be in the lab at times and you'll have to do things on your own like identifying species. Just great experience. 